The Customs of China acts as the major gateway controller of goods, personnel, and their carriers crossing the border of mainland China. Apart from tax collection, anti-smuggling, and port management, one important function of the customs is to inspect compliance of goods with applicable national and international laws, especially after the formal entry-exit inspection and quarantine bureau is integrated into the customs in 2018. The customs exercises entry-exit inspection or quarantine mainly on human health, goods, animals, plants, and food. The types of entry exist inspection and quarantine are indicated by letters. Certain imported mechanical or electrical goods, such as engines, compressors, and printers, are required to obtain a quality license or the China compulsory certification. The goods successfully going through the entry exit inspection and quarantine will obtain the entry exit inspection and quarantine certificate issued by the customs. The certificate shows the legality of the source of cargo and compliance with Chinese inspection and quarantine regulations and standards. However, the certificate does not guarantee that the goods comply with applicable Chinese product quality and consumer protection regulations enforced by the State Administration for Market Regulation. The entry-exit inspection can be divided into statutory inspection and random inspection. The goods subject to mandatory inspections are listed in the catalogue of commodities subject to inspection and quarantine by entry-exit inspection and quarantine agencies. For the other goods, the customs may conduct random inspections. Apart from the general inspection and quarantine supervision on goods, certain products are subject to extra inspection and documentation requirements, such as solid waste used as raw materials, used mechanical and electrical products, hazardous chemicals and their containers, cosmetics, and foods. For example, manufacturers of imported meat, aquatic products, dairy products, and bird nest products must register with the General Administration of Customs of China. Exporters and importers of imported food, or their agents, must make a filing with the customs. Besides exercising inspection and quarantine on arrived cargo, the customs also monitors and assesses product safety and quality risks in China and foreign countries. The sources of information may come from local customs, international organizations, civil societies, or consumers. Once a risk is identified, the General Administration of Customs will send corresponding risk warnings to local customs, manufacturers, and consumers. If necessary, the customs may decide to adopt quick response measures such as tightened inspection and quarantine or emergency control against the relevant imported goods.